What's up guys, Peso here. Welcome to my tutorial. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to make wallpaper using the Samoforte and Photoshop. The versions is doesn't matter, but I'm using the Samoforte R13 and Photoshop CS6. And so you can use the any version, but I'm using this one. So, as you can see here is the uh, tutorial preview for my wallpaper and uh, if you don't see this go to my channel and check this out I put the link in the description so I made this wallpaper for my friend his name is Deskwitz on YouTube so I put his channel link in the description making the gameplay commentaries and other stuff like that so uh, go to his channel and check this out and don't forget to subscribe if you like his videos I'm already subscribed so I am already upload the files uh, to upload.net here is the files you need in the in this tutorial it's free to download click free download and wait 30 seconds and click download so let's take a look at the files. Here is the two flares, three lights, and two texture, and also the Lightroom for demo for the and breaking text. So we need the two plugins uh, for demo for the in this tutorial. It's called uh, Tracy and Crippler. It doesn't include it in the file, so you can download it by searching on the Google how to download and uh, install Gribbles and Trace a plugin for some of our day. And you can watch the video in the YouTube. So I'm already installed it. So let's get started. First, open the some of our day and go to file and click open and open this Lightroom included in the files and go to more graph more text and go to object and change align to middle and drag it into the center like so and write your text I'm gonna write DSQ and you can use the and the text but I'm using this one and change the depths a uh, hundred and go to font and select this one right there uh, you can use the any font in uh, this tutorial but I'm using this font that's why it doesn't include it in the files uh, but this font is the best I'm using it on my tutorial so go to caps and make the start fillet cap and do the same on the end and change the radius from 5 to 2 cm okay now go to more text and press ctrl C then ctrl B on your keyboard and go to the second text and go to caps and change it 2 cm to 4 cm and click this icon right there and change the camera and make the second text a little uh, bit right there make it behind the first text like so okay now here we have two material black and blue and we need to drag the black color into the first text just drag and drop and we need to drag the blue color into the second text 
so it looks very nice I'm choosing the blue and black color so you can uh, make change the color whatever you want just go to material and go to color and select whatever you want so and select to text and go to plugins tracer and click tracer and I'm choosing to sort the pieces it's very nice for this text and click breakdown it doesn't take the so long it usually takes two minutes or one minute so uh, I'm gonna pause this video so I will come back when this breaking is done okay guys I'm come back and the breaking is completed so uh, we don't need the choice anymore just close it then go to um, plugins gribbles and select gribbles and select the first object hold shift and select the last object and drag uh, this object into the gribbles so go to gribbles and go to the stock gribbles and uncheck this one generate gribbles then go to objects and select this one gribble back of polygons check this out and go to base I'm choosing the minimum 2 cm maximum 10 cm it uh, looks nice in this text so the recommended is 2 cm and 10 cm okay here we got nice broken text looks awesome I'm gonna zoom in a little bit then here we are ready to render it just go to render settings and change the uh, size 1280 by 720 go to anti aliasing and change this best from geometry to best I'm choosing the minimum one maximum two the recommended is four but I'm choosing the two because my PC and uh, my laptop is very slow if you select this for the render time is take so long if you have the faster PC or laptop select the 4 so go to global illumination and go to irradiant sketch and make this 2 first 2 low it's increase the rendering time so go to save I'm gonna save it to my desktop and name it text or whatever you want click save and uh, make sure the alpha channel is selected this is important for your text if you doesn't uh, if you don't check this alpha channel uh, your text isn't trust uh, isn't rendered with transparent background so you need to check this and change the format to png right there png and close this and click this render button it takes a little bit long so I will be come back when the rendering is done